Om. In this session, we will explore the life-changing possibilities of trust and courage. How we can actually make a difference on the surface of this planet. A heartfelt speech to connect to our true essence, to a deeper meaning of life. Please, be open to receive the inspiration. Check it out. Om. In this session, we will explore integrity, standing up for the righteousness in our own life and generally on this planet. It is urgently needed that someone takes responsibility, that someone supports the process of clarity, purity, sincerity and peace. We need to bring more purity to life. There's so much negativity, shadows, and even vicious darkness. So much manipulation, self-righteousness of taking advantage, ego-centered attitudes with which we do too much, exaggerate, take too much from other people and Mother Earth, where we are just out of control. We need to counterbalance this excessive human exaggeration and come back to a happy balance, to a neutral center, which doesn't get lost in obsessive extremes. The invitation is to cultivate integrity, meaning that we take responsibility not just for our own well-being, but also for the well-being of the people in our direct surroundings, but generally on the planet. And not just for humans, but also for the animal kingdom and the biosphere of the magnificent plants. We are used to focusing on our own well-being. And also that is important. To cultivate this inner balance and harmony is actually the foundation. We need to find peace within ourselves before we can share it with others. So the invitation is to Appreciate and love ourselves, but not in a selfish way. But with integrity, we acknowledge also our shortcomings. And we don't beat ourselves up for them, but we see them clearly for what they are. And that is sometimes not so easy if we have to acknowledge a certain unethical tendency in ourselves where we are overdoing it, taking more than is given to us, more than we actually need, over-consuming. My tendency is over-talking, speaking too much, and then not having space to listen to others receiving, being sensitive. My typology is more the active, strong, engaging, but then the danger is that we get too blunt and step on other people's toes. So counterbalancing the active with the passive tendency, not just Activism, I save the world. That's amazing as an attitude and can make a whole lot of difference. Sure. But it can also be that we're in this hyperactivity, very self-centered, and we're kind of performing well, and I save the world. <laughs> yeah. It's kind of me in the center, the savior. 
so a certain humbleness, maybe even a humility at times in this gratitude for, wow, a sensitivity, receptivity, and also just a moment to passively wait, not just for time to pass, but to observe, to see clearly what is the appropriate response to this challenge, what is the right course of action. And then, with wisdom, choosing the wise, appropriate response. So, integrity, balance between the two extremes, and in a way, a commitment to the higher good, to sublime ideals, Lofty ideals with a head up in the sky, but with both feet rooted in the ground, like a hero standing up for the righteousness on this planet. If it's not we who are standing up, who else? Now is the time for somebody to step forward. The unfinished work of our heroes must truly be our own. That's a song by Ben Harper. And he gets inspired by Martin Luther King Jr. Others get inspired by Nelson Mandela or Mahatma Gandhi. Or your local hero, who is maybe still alive, or someone in whose footsteps we walk, continuing their mission. Now it's our turn. We are at the forefront of the human development. Who in your community will stand up? How can you contribute to support them? How can I make at least a small difference? How can I overcome my doubts of helplessness that I just Does it really make a difference what I do? Yes, it does. Because if everybody thinks like, oh, what difference will it make? It's just a drop on the hot stone. Then we go downhill and we exploit the planet and other people. So please, stand up in a humble way. Step forward, speak up, make a difference. It saves the day. It can make the whole difference. A small step for humanity, but a big step in our community, in my commitment to a better world. A small yet significant contribution Dare to share and allow yourself to be courageous, to think big, maybe even very big. Dare for the moonshot. Maybe you don't want to go to Mars, but just protect life on this earth. We are connected and together in this. So thank you. Thank you for walking your talk. For practicing what we preach. Thank you for making a difference. Even if nobody says thank you, we feel it in our heart that it matters and it gives meaning to our life. Stay strong and humble. Namaste. I trust that you appreciate the inspiration and I hope that you will have the courage to actually make a difference in your community. And if you like, 
leave some of your mature life experience in the comments down below. And if you appreciated the content, maybe even like the video or follow us on the different platforms. I'm sending you lots of life-loving wishes from the Balinese, your capital of Buddha.